Well, I can see that the momentum is with the household charge payment, and I'm delighted that so many people over the last 48 hours have seen that it is very important to have local services delivered by local contributions, uh, and it is a fundamental change to the thinking of which we have to do in terms of financing local government. Uh, and I uh, would want to encourage people that whoever has left uh, the farm one side or have yet to uh, contribute online or through the local authority or through on post by poster order, that they will do so by the end of business tomorrow evening on Saturday evening, because I think most people want to comply with the law. What I would say to people is that this country is in a very serious financial situation. And it has been that way for a, a period of time. This is the, a condition attached to complying with the EU IMF agreement, who ultimately are the people that are paying for the for public services. We have 18 billion of a gap between income and expenditure. The money has to come from somewhere. And in spite of the difficulties that people are going through at the moment personally, I think it's a great tribute to the Irish people that they're working in community solidarity with the government to get us out of this mess as quickly as possible and pay for local services by making their contribution locally. To assist to close the gap in our public finances, we have to broaden the tax base to include a property tax, a, top property, a property tax base charge that is less harmful than taxes on work and investment. I know that no new taxes are popular. The household charge is no exception. But it is needed to fund essential services in every city, in every town, and in every village in our country. I want to thank all those who have registered and paid this charge to date. I welcome indeed the very significant increase in the numbers registering in the past few days. And I urge all others now to make their contribution to the restoration of sound public finances in this country by registering between now and the deadline at midnight tomorrow and thereby abiding by the law of the land. Charge, yes, I believe like any tax it should be paid. I, I don't like paying TV licenses, uh, but I still pay it. Uh, it's, it's, it's a tax and that's, that's, the, that's the law. If I don't want to pay a tax and if I disagree with something, I'll, I'll vote against uh, the government that do it. But I'm actually in favour of this particular tax. Uh, I think we need local taxes in this country. So I, I'm, I was happy to pay it. Why did I pay it? Because the law. Okay? And for 35 years, we didn't have to pay it. So now we do. And we're one of the last countries in Europe to have to pay property tax, so why not? So that's why I paid it. I see no problem in it whatsoever. Uh, I think, you know, in some counties we're getting great value for it. Other counties may not be getting as good a value. But by and large, there is good value. I live in Kildare. We're putting in a new water tree abstraction system from the barrow. It will cost, it's costing 26 million. It costs 3.4 million to run it. Who's going to pay for it? If we want water, here's one way of ensuring that we're going to get it. So it's about time that people... We did wake up to the fact that we need these things. These are water is life saving. And if we don't face up to it and if we don't have it then we have problems.